Making CT scans safer. That's what's happening at one Philadelphia hospital. Health reporter Stephanie Stahl is here with the details in tonight's Einstein Science Center report. Very interesting stuff, guys. You know, CT scans are an essential diagnostic tool. Tens of millions are performed every year. Now, research from Einstein has established a way to reduce radiation exposure from the imaging. Diana Mora has to get routine CT scans to monitor her advanced kidney disease. This is basically a cross-section of the abdomen. Now, thanks to new research from Dr. Ryan Lee, Chief of Neuroradiology at Einstein Medical Center, Diana is getting a lower dose of radiation with the scans. And if I have to have these tests done, I'd rather have it at that low rate right. instead of a high rate and then worry about in the future. The worry is that radiation from CT scans could potentially cause cancer. Especially with the increased use of CAT scans, there is more of a concern for cancer. And so if we can minimize the amount of radiation we give to our patients, we can lower that risk. Dr. Lee and his team have established a new way to standardize CT scans and lower the radiation dose by about 40 percent. Anybody can decrease dose. The trick is to decrease dose and preserve the quality, or in some cases, some of our protocols, we actually increase the quality of our scans. Computed tomography or CT scans use hundreds of x-rays to create detailed 3D images that enable doctors to see things previously visible only through biopsy or surgery. They're an invaluable diagnostic tool, but there's no standard for radiation dosing. Ours, as far as we know, is one of the first ones to describe a method for consistently administering the same amount of radiation dose for each CAT scan. Einstein is now using advanced software to standardize CT scans at all its centers. And experts say children and people who get repeated CT scans face the biggest risk. The FDA says there is a lot of, quote, uncertainty about potential harms.